to say that I am moving and I can't wait to move to my new place. I right now live in a studio in the CBD in Melbourne, Australia, and I'm moving to a two bedroom apartment in the suburbs. So I'm very excited to furnish my entire room because where I'm living now is a bit like a hotel. So it just doesn't really feel like home. It's a bit too sterile. So I'm super excited to finally move to somewhere that will feel more homey and definitely a little less scary being on the 25th floor and having fire alarms happen all the time. This is the status of my place. We'll make the bed, but it is pretty much emptied out. I took everything out of the closet and the kitchen, and here is everything I practically own, which I would say, again, pretty minimalist for also moving six times in one year because I've moved so much, but I have all my clothes in here, have stuff for, oh gosh, look at my tan line. Let's not look at that, okay. I have all my stuff for the kitchen and for cleaning supplies in there, an air fryer, this is camera equipment, my roller blades, this is kitchen equipment, shoes, and then all of my bedding. And of course my plants, gotta have those. So that is everything. And we're going to go have some breakfast. My boyfriend is here helping me and then we're going to get the car. I'm gonna rent the car, bring it over here, get all of this stuff into the car and then drive to the new place and unload it. And then we have someone coming who's going to build the bed for me and get my uh, bed and mattress into my bedroom. And then we're gonna take a road trip to go pick up some nightstands. So it's gonna be a busy day, but I'm really, really excited. First things first, we gotta fuel ourselves. So I'm having a banana and then we're gonna go get some bagels and coffee because the coffee in Melbourne is amazing. I don't know how much I've talked about it on my channel, but the coffee here is unreal. So we gotta fuel ourselves with some coffee and some food and then we'll be able to move everything. just got the car and we're gonna go get everything from my building and load it up into the trunk and I live smack in the city so it was quite scary driving here but we made it successfully and I parallel parked on the side of the road so let's load up the car Cause I already planned my day at home And if I had the chance then I would try We're gonna go find some tables and also a lamp I'm putting together a lamp right now and I realized we got the wrong light bulb. <laughs> what? I don't know what you're talking about. Are you talking to yourself? <laughs> Why are you vlogging, you weirdo? He hates my vlogs, guys. I'm not, I'm not denying it. Especially the ones of you moving houses. Why does anyone want to see? Apparently he thinks no one wants to see this content. So everyone let me know in the comments below if you're liking this kind of video. Because no, he's a hater. I don't want to be in these videos because then I'll get heaps of haters. Blah, 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 like, blah, blah, blah. Oh, that Lockie guy's a dickhead. <laughs> anyway, here's our little living room. Lockie's trying to build my nightstand. And it's not going too well. Hey, no, it at least. Is. Oh, it is? Yeah, really well. Oh, I think looking at AFL scores is definitely what's helping you out right now, right? Yep. For me personally over here, um, I'm trying to do the lamps, but like I said, the light bulbs were the wrong ones. But I'm putting the lamps together. And this is my bed. And then I have all my bedding in here, so I'm going to put the bedding on here. It's like 7 p.m. now, so I'm going to just keep putting stuff together. Hey. Good morning everyone, it is 8.30 and I just finished my last workout in the amazing gym at my apartment complex and it's time that I say goodbye to this insane view of the city and the pool as well, it's been so fun. But I'm checking out of this place today and saying my goodbyes and going to my new place this afternoon. 
Good morning, everyone. I am packing up my last things into this uh, bag so I can take everything I have left in this apartment. And I'm gonna take it to work because my work's really close to here. And then after work, take it all back to my new place. And it feels really weird. Like this is gonna be the third time I've moved in Australia. And each place has a very special um, place in my heart. So even though I only lived here for two months, almost three, this was such a fun chapter of my life. And I'm so happy it happened but it's now time to move to the next place. And this time stay a bit longer than I have at my previous places, but it definitely is a bittersweet leaving. It's 9 a.m. though, so it's time to get everything I need and head out, check out, and say my goodbyes. So yeah, I'm pretty much ready to go. I will be carrying a lot with me. I have this whole Woolies bag of items. And then over here, let me show you. Over here, we have my work bag, my yoga mat, and I also have my mattress quilt. So lots of things. And yeah, I'm gonna have to carry it all. So hopefully I'll be okay. But I'm pretty much done, guys. That's it. That's it. Goodbye, city apartment. I'm gonna miss you. And I'm also gonna miss this amazing city view. But it's time to head out and go on to my next chapter. Bye. Hello everybody, welcome, welcome. It is my first evening at my new apartment and I just finished setting it up. I'm trying to decide which color sheets I should go with though. So I might ask you guys and have you comment down below which color you like better. Let me show you. So here's my bed right now. I'm trying to decide if we should be doing some blue sheets or white. And the reason why is because I'm thinking the white doesn't look right with the beige. So I feel like the blue matches a bit more than the white does. So let me know what you guys think. But overall, the room is all set up and my closet looks really, really good. Super organized and clean. As you can see, got all my shoes down there. And then on this side, we have some nice closet space too, which is all folded. It looks really, really good. It feels really weird to be in a new home, but I know I will adjust to it quickly and I am excited for this new little chapter of my life in Melbourne and I hope you enjoyed following along with me this weekend as I moved from one apartment to another. And now I'm going to finish setting up and then I'm going to go to a dance class with my friend Mojo. We're going to go do a pop commercial dance class. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll be back with more videos about my life in Melbourne very soon. See you then. Bye!